Good morning, children. Today we are going to learn a new lesson from your non-detailed text vistas. The first story, third level, written by Jack Finney. This story is written with the fictional device of time travel. If you don't understand the use of time travel in this story, you may feel a little difficult to grasp the content of this story. So in this video lesson, I would like to explain what is this time travel concept and how is it used in the third level. Along with that, I will give you the theme, important characters and places in the story and you will get an introduction also. Let us move on to understand these things. One thing, if you haven't subscribed my channel, subscribe it and press the bell icon. Then you will get notifications of my next video. Let us go. Let us learn a little about the author Jack Finney who wrote the brilliant time travel story third level. He was an American author born in the year 1911. He graduated from Knox College in Galesburg, Illinois. This Galesburg, Illinois is a significant place that appears in the story because the protagonist wants to go back to Galesburg, Illinois of 1890s. When we come back to the author, he lived in New York and worked there for an advertising agency and later moved to California. His best known works are science fictions and thrillers. His famous two books are Body Snatchers and Time and Again. He passed away in the year 1995. For a better understanding of the story, we have to understand the concept of time travel. Actually, time travel is a plot device in fiction. This plot device started using in fictions in the 19th century. The general concept is that we always traveling through time as we move from the past into the future. That is the general concept about time. But time travel usually refers to the possibility of changing the rate at which we travel. Sometimes we travel into future and sometimes we travel into the past. At the same time, we remain at the present time. At the present time. This traveling of time backwards and forward is known as time travel in fiction. Time travel usually taken to mean that a person's mind and body remain unchanged. There is no changes happening with the character's mind and body. And his memories are intact. In the concept of time travel, mind and body remain unchanged and memories are in good condition. 
they are not affected any way badly while their location time is changed then if the traveler's body and mind reported its condition at the destination time if a character's body and mind reported reported means changed as accordingly go backward into the time then no time travel would be perceptible then it is not seen the concept of time travel when the mind and the body remain unchanged and his memories are intact we can say that it is the concept of time travel so this time travel device plot device is used in the story third level is that clear now let us learn a little about the story the third level without an introduction we can't clearly understand the story fully here the narrator he interviews fantasy with reality this is what the thread on which the story is done. sometimes it is fantasy and sometimes it is reality and the story is woven in the frame of time travel that i have already explained time travel concept is the characters remain in the present but somehow they travel backward or forward in time so here charlie a young new york office goer one day he loses his way at the grand central station grand central railway station that is in new york manhattan city he loses his way he finds himself in what he thinks is the third level of the railway station and when he loses his way finally he reaches at a third level of the railway station but the reality is that the grand central railway station has subways on two levels only there is no third level that is the reality but the narrator believes that he reaches at the third level and in these two levels the commuters take train to different destinations commuters means the travelers one who travels regularly is known as commuter so these commuters take train to different destinations from these two subways no third level was exist that is the reality no third level was exist however charlie believes in the existence of a third level this is the fantasy part of the story the protagonist charlie believes in the existence of a third level which is operating in a time frame of 18 90s and this third level is operating trains at a time frame of 1890s the story is happening at present it is written in the year 1950 we can consider it as present time and the writer travels back to the year 18 90s it is a time of peace and content life so what is the reason why which he wants to travel back because in 1890s it is a time of peace and content life which is not possible in the present era in the present era of the rat race 
the protagonist can't find peace and contentment. So he goes back to the year 1890s. From this third level, Charlie wants to travel to Galesburg, Illinois, the city of Galesburg in the state of Illinois, with his wife Louisa. He wants to travel back to time in a place called Galesburg, Illinois, with his wife Louisa. For him, it is a part of reality. But the protagonist can't differentiate what is fantasy in him and what is reality. This is where the confusion and the complexity of the story lies. He can't differentiate between what is fantasy and what is reality in him. His mind and body are intact, but travels back to a time in 1890s. His psychiatrist friend calls it a waking dream wish fulfillment. So he has a psychiatrist friend. Sometimes he consults with him and he calls his Mind's phenomena as a waking dream wish fulfillment, which means a pleasant wish that makes you forget about the present. A pleasant wish that makes you forget about the present. That is the problem with Charlie, as according to his friend and the psychiatrist Sam. This is the background in which we have to read the story third level. Now let us discuss the theme of the story, the third level. The story concisely presents the fiction device of time travel that we have already discussed in the previous sessions. How does the writer use the concept of time travel in the story. The protagonist wants to travel a peaceful place. For that, he travels in time backward in the year 1894. This is one of the themes of the story. The protagonist wants to travel a peaceful place. What does he do for that? He travels in time backward and reaches in the year 1894. He finds some comfort there in the past time. The question of existing of the third level and 1894 Galesburg can be inferred from Samson's letter. These two fictional factors of the story the existing of the third level and 1894 Galesburg that we can infer from Sam's letter. Sam is Charlie's friend and psychiatrist that we will discuss in the last part of the story. The story also reveals the theme of escapism. This is one of the major themes of the story, escapism. And this escapism is not only as a psychological refuge from the grim realities of present life, but also as a desire to stay with the past. This is the escapist concept in the story. The protagonist wants to go back to a past time. Not only because of he wants to escape from the grim realities of present life, but also his strong desire to stay with the past. He wants to keep alive the past in the complexities of the present. So that is the 
another theme discussed in the story the protagonist wants to keep alive the past in the complexities of the present some reasons are there some reasons are behind this desire when we learn the story we can understand it very clearly so these are the themes discussed in the story now let us come to know about the characters and the places in the story the protagonist is charlie he is an office goer in new york he is a 31 year old man luisa she is charlie's wife sam vena he is a psychiatrist and a friend of charlie another character is a clerk he is seen at the ticket window at the third level then president cleveland the american president during 1893-97 when the story takes place next is grand central station it's a railway station in new york midtown manhattan then galesburg a city in knox county illinois state usa illinois is a state in usa it is known as the land of lincoln as abraham lincoln spent most of his lifetime these are the characters and places come throughout the story the third level 